This is the Christmas season, that special time of year when we feel a special closeness to our loved ones. And right now, Corliss is thinking about a loved one and what to do about his Christmas present. I'll wear the bracelet Daddy gives me on this wrist. <laughs> Mrs. Archer is thinking about her Christmas presents, too. I'll wear the fur jacket that Harry gives me to the Patterson party. <laughs> Mr. Archer is thinking about his Christmas presents, too. Well, one thing is sure. As usual, Mr. Archer is going to have a white Christmas. <laughs> going to find out what my presents are to you until Christmas. All right, Harry, if you don't want us to know, we won't try to find out. We'll just wait until Christmas. Might as well. The way I've got them hit this year, you'll never find them. <laughs> <laughs> that won't be any good. The presents are not in my pockets. I've already hidden them and you'll never find them. <laughs> Honestly, you women and your curiosity are just like kids. You don't have to hide my presents. I'm not curious. I wait until Christmas to find out what you got me. <laughs> I'm not curious about what's in here. Although I could probably find out with very little trouble. <laughs> I have a notion I'm getting an ocean of lotion. <laughs> At my house, everybody's curious about Christmas presents. My children wonder what they're going to get. My wife wonders what she ought to give. I wonder how I'm going to pay. Hi, Harry. Hi, Bill. Yeah, there's Daddy's little helper. What do I do? Start decorating. All right. Hey, I hear you have your women folk guessing about your Christmas present. Oh, Bill, the trouble they've been giving me. Searching all over the house, getting into everything. Oh, Bill, these women. Well, of course. I can handle women better than you can because I understand them better than you do. Oh. Yeah, sure. You know, I know everything Mary's going to say any time of the day or night. <laughs> Hello, anybody home here? Here, Mary. Watch. Oh, there you are, Bill. When I asked you to beat the rugs and clean out the garage and straighten up the cellar, you said you were too tired. But here you are, working as if you were loaded with energy. See? <laughs> All right, dear, I'll be over as soon as I've finished here with Harry. Yeah, now come over and help him, Mary. After all, one good turn deserves another. Okay, thanks. Where's Janet? In the kitchen. Thank you. Say, this is beginning to look pretty good. Yep, sure is. <laughs> 
<laughs> Dexter. Oh, hi. Anything I can do to help? No. no. Oh. Well, if you fellas need me, you just call. <laughs> Thank you, Dexter. Goodbye, Dexter. <laughs> Oh, by the way. Yes. Well, I was wondering if I could ask you a favor, Mr. Archer. Well, whatever the question is, the answer is yes. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> Good goodbye, Dexter. <laughs> Don't you even want to know what the favor is? <laughs> All right. What is it? Well, I'd like to borrow your tool shed to make my Christmas presents in. To make your Christmas presents in? Yeah, I'm making all my Christmas presents this year. I think it lends them the personal touch. Well, that's a very nice sentiment, Dexter. It shows thought and goodwill and understanding. Yeah, that's me, full of thought and goodwill and understanding. Why? Besides, all my money's tied up in debts. <laughs> okay, Dexter, you can use my tool shed. Well, thank you very much, Mr. Archer. Goodbye, <laughs> Dexter. Dexter. Hey, <laughs> you know why you two guys keep getting off those ladders? You, you think I'm going to knock you down or do something clumsy or break something or something? <laughs> well? I haven't broken anything. Don't press your luck. Well, okay, man. I'm off. <laughs> <laughs> Look, no hands. <laughs> I never have any trouble decorating our tree. I've got it down to a system. First, I have it delivered about two weeks in advance. Then I order the prettiest ornaments available. Then I go to a movie, and when I come home, my wife's got that tree looking absolutely beautiful. Now, Corliss, nobody's going to find out what kind of Christmas presents I'm making. Not until Christmas. Well, if you want to help me, okay. But no more peeking. All right, Dexter. What do you want me to do? Well, um, how about cleaning up that junk over there? Orlis, you're under the mistletoe. <laughs> Sorry, Dexter. That's what you get for trying to steal a kiss before Christmas. I guess I lost my head. Also a couple of teeth. <laughs> well, back to work. You know, I really should get those things to hang even. How the heck with it? <laughs> Holy cow. I'll bet you even Thomas Edison couldn't figure that one out. Well, let's see if they all work. Well, thanks for your help, Bill. I think we did a pretty good job. Ah, oh, it looks beautiful. That lovely tree all burned up. A moment ago, it was a lovely bright pine. Now it's just a silly ash. Good morning, Archer. Good morning, Mary. Hi, Mary. Had your breakfast? Yes, but I'm open to offers. Dexter comes by his appetite honestly. <laughs> She's trying to ask you if you found my Christmas present yet. <laughs> the answer is no, and she's not going to. And now, ladies, a pleasant good morning to you both. Isn't that just like a man? Isn't what just like a man? Being right. <laughs> yes. Did you look for those presents in here? Well, where would he hide them in here? Well... There's room back here. Hmm? Oh. Lose something? <laughs> well, uh, we're, uh, um, aren't we, Mary? Uh, why, sure. Uh, that's what we were doing. Well, you see, uh, Janet and I decided to clean the kitchen floor, so we were just looking behind the refrigerator to see if it was dusty. Right, Janet? Right. That's what I call being real neighborly. 
Back to Meet Corliss Archer. Darling, isn't that my drawer? Well, I guess I must have been confused. Well, that's perfectly natural. We've only had the dress of 20 years. <laughs> By the way, darling, that isn't where I hid the Christmas presents. I'm not being curious. It's just that if I don't know what you're buying for me, I won't know what to exchange. <laughs> and if I can't find out until after Christmas, there won't be as good a selection to exchange for. <laughs> so I'm not being curious, I'm just being realistic. So it'd be much better if you tell me where the presents are and what they are so I can plan. After all, Harry, all I'm asking you to do is to look at the problem realistically. <laughs> present. Beautiful present. <laughs> Mustn't tell where they're hidden. <laughs> present for Corliss. where he had the present. that a mere male has two women on a string. <laughs> women are supposed to be the weaker sex. But the sad truth is that they're weak from laughing at their husband's weakness. I'm sure I'll find it in here. I've looked every other place in the house. Here in some place. Just keep looking, darling. Oh, no, Harry. Are you aware of the tragedies that are caused by idle curiosity? Never thought about it. You know, curiosity was the cause of the famous Dieseldorf case. Dieseldorf case? I never heard of that. What was that? Mr. Dorf ran over his wife with a diesel. <laughs> and what had that to do with curiosity? Well, he was curious to see if she was keeping up the payments on her insurance. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Dexter, that's enough. Aren't you just a little embarrassed that I found you doing this? Why should I be? Hmm. Oh, Dexter, here's the hot water bottle. I knew I'd find it. Oh, good. Dear, would you put these back in the closet? Uh, Dexter, what in the world? Dexter, here's the green thread you mm -hmm. wanted. The bar of soap, the magnet, and the water tub. Good. And here's the pearl button. Yeah. The siphon. Yeah. The beeswax. Mm -hmm. And the green sheet. Oh, good. <laughs> well, thanks, Mrs. Archer. Back to work. Uh, what are you doing with all that? Oh, this stuff is for the Christmas presents I'm making. What are you making? It's a secret. Aren't you going to put those back in the closet, dear? 
What in the world is he making? I don't know. Beeswax. Siphon. Cream cheese. A, a hot water bottle. What's going on? Whatever Dexter's making can't be any queerer than some of the things my mother-in-law gives me for Christmas. Last year, she gave me a set of automobile maps. But I don't have a car. I finally figured out that was her way of saying, Merry Christmas. Hit the road, you bum. <laughs> I uh, just happened to be passing by. Oh. Well, I moved the hinges from one side of the door to the other, but I haven't moved the doorknob yet. Uh, Dexter, what are you making in there? Uh, 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 Mr. Archer, remember the famous Dieseldorf case? Uh, but the, the beeswax, the hot water bottle, the thread, the, the cream cheese. Uh, after all, Dexter, we're old friends. As man to man. Well, you need any help? Is there anything I can do? Yeah, as a matter of fact, if you'd like to come in for a minute, there is something you could do. Oh, that's fine. Now, uh, what do you want me to do? What are you making? Uh, I mean, what do you want me to do? Oh, well, I'm going to put some glue on here, and then you can hold it in position in the vise while I clamp it, okay? Huh? Here. That's it. Yeah, like that. Now, Dexter. Uh, huh? Dexter. Oh. Oh, holy cow. <laughs> the time. Right. Oh. oh, well, I gotta find that handle. It must be around here somewhere. <laughs> Never mind, Dexter. Holy cow. Well, how could you get caught in a vice with such a short tie? <laughs> is there anything else I can do to help? Oh, yeah, as a matter of fact, there is. Um, would you hold this nail? Hmm? Thank you. Uh. <laughs> Let me get this straight. You want me to hold this nail while you hit it with a hammer, is that right? Oh, yeah, it'll only take a second. So would getting shot. <laughs> All right. But you better hit the nail. <laughs> well, Mr. Archer, if you're so worried about your finger, why don't you hit the nail? Makes sense. <laughs> it's only cold. Well, it's only cold. There, put your finger in there. <laughs> Lou. Um, don't, don't worry, Mr. Archer. I, I think I can get it off. What do you know? A glue-sickle. <laughs> oh, don't worry, Mr. Archer. I can get it off, I'm sure. Here, just put your finger there. <clears throat> I have two words for you, Dexter. What? Goodbye. <laughs> Mr. Archer. Mr. Archer, before you go, wouldn't you do me another favor? I mean, I just want to... This is very simple. What? Well, I was hoping that you'd hold this board while I, I drilled a hole in it, you know? Nothing can happen. <laughs> Well, just an idle curiosity. I'd like to see if it's possible. Oh, there's nothing to worry about. Oh. No hammer, no glue, no vice. Just hold the board, right? Right. All oh, right. Okay. It's a little hard to get started. <coughs> <There>. <coughs> 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 Mr. Archer, I can get it off for you. Mm. Uh. <laughs> Mr. Archer, I... Uh. <laughs> <laughs> <Bye. laughs> 
Mr. Archer, I, I, I moved the hinges, remember? <laughs> Don't worry, I'll do it for you. <laughs> <laughs> you won't tell anybody what you saw here, will you? It looks like a bang-up Christmas for Mr. Archer. When he went into Dexter's workshop, you could scarcely imagine a more upstanding man. When he came out, he was a man who could scarcely imagine standing up anymore. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Daddy. Oh, thank you, baby. And now for my presents to you. You know, this is the first Christmas that you haven't known in advance just what you were going to get from me. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas! Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! From my darling husband. <laughs> from my adoring wife. <laughs> oh. Harry, what about those presents you've been hiding? Oh, I was just telling Janet. Merry Cor Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas, Mister. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Mrs. Archer. This is my present to you. I made it myself. <laughs> Why, that's just beautiful, Dexter. What is it? <laughs> it's a Dexter Franklin recliner seat. Sit down. Okay, go ahead. You'll love it. <laughs> there. Isn't that comfortable? Isn't it relaxing? <laughs> it's just wonderful. Harry, help. This is only the beginning. <laughs> Harry, what about those presents you've been hiding? Well, I was just telling you, Carla. Oh, Merry Christmas. <laughs> this is for you. Golly, Dex, thank you so much. It's uh, just what I've always wanted. Do you know what it is? Um, sure. Well, how did you guess? Well, it's perfectly obvious. Yeah, I guess it is. Well, how does it feel to be the only girl in town with an automatic window closer? A what? Don't you get it, Pop? On those cold winter mornings, this automatic window closer will close when it calls his window automatically. You don't even have to get out of bed to do it. <laughs> oh. But you want to see how it works? Watch. Uh, you just set the alarm. Just flip the switch. Presto. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I worked hard on it. I, I really did. I don't want this to be the merriest Christmas ever. Oh, Dex, please don't feel bad. Please don't, Dex. I don't really care about the present. Really, I don't. What's really important is that, well, that I know you love me. Oh, uh, holy cow, Carlos, everyone's looking. Sorry, Dex. We all want you to have a Merry Christmas, too. Holy cow! <laughs> Mr. Archer, I've got one present for you. I guarantee you won't break. It's out in the backyard. Wait a minute. I can't stand the suspense any longer. If I don't get to see your presents pretty soon, I'm gonna blow my top. All right. Now, has anybody any idea where I hit him? No. no. Come on, Harry. That's enough build-up. Go get them. All right. Uh, What's the matter, Harry? Well... What is it, Harry? I forgot where I hit him. Oh, no. <laughs> now, no, wait a minute. Just give me a minute. I'll be able to think of it. It's no use. Oh, this is great. Oh, Harry, you've kept us in suspense long enough. All right, darling. <laughs> Dexter, you say you have something you want to show us in the backyard? Right. So have I. Follow me. Get your Christmas present, Mr. Archer. You are going to lay the cement walk for months now, so I did it for you. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Oh, no, this can't be true. What is it, Harry? Right here, under what is now a cement walk, is where I hid your presents. Good job, Mr. Archer. Thank you, Dexter. Dinner's ready, Harry. Go oh, on, be right in, dear. It's your favorite day after Christmas dinner. Yeah, what? Spaghetti and meatballs. Oh, man, why didn't you say so? That's for me. Uh, Boy, that sounds great. 
You're invited too, Dexter. I am? Oh, boy, I... <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.